Hey guys, so I am doing an unboxing and review video. So we got something from Pottery Barn Baby that we've been waiting on forever. And we're gonna unbox it and Leslie oh. is joining me for today's video. Fitting since this is for her. Uh, she won't let mommy put her down, so. Mommy's holding her. Keeping the little baby happy. Um, before I unbox it and do my personal review on it, just kinda wanted to share some background on this thing. We had put this on our registry in September, and we had this and a regular um, horse version. So this is the unicorn version. We had a horse version based on if it was a boy or a girl. And once we knew it was a girl, we removed the horse and got the unicorn. And we were very excited about this thing because it's the cutest thing ever. And our baby shower was in October. So once it was on the registry, it was, in stock good to go no problems right now i work in e-commerce that's literally what i do so i have a very personal <laughs> opinion about back orders and inventory and all that stuff because i deal with it every day so when a company kind of drags something on like this it's not the best customer experience so um let's just hope that this was worth it i think it is but we're gonna see so when it was put on the registry, like I said, it was good to go. But then it went on back order until February. So it was purchased and we weren't expecting it until February, which was fine. Like it's not a big deal. You know, it was for the nursery, but Isaac's not gonna be able to use it. She's not gonna care. She's not gonna even be sleeping in her nursery at first. So who cares, no big deal. We don't need to like have everything perfect for her nursery right away. So no big deal, right? My mom was the one who purchased it for us. Um, it was obviously intended to be a baby shower gift and so when we were expecting it in February we're like oh okay well it's okay it's just a belated baby shower gift well then she got a notice that it was put on back order even further till April it's in March that my mom got another email saying oh by the way this is now not going to arrive till May oh and it's also going to you in Poway not Texas and to an address that doesn't exist so my mom yeah right it's ridiculous my mom had to call and be like, um, this is an address that doesn't exist. It also needs to <laughs> go to Texas, not Poway, California, so please fix this. And the customer service was great. I mean, they definitely made it up to my mom and, um, you know, no complaints there. But it definitely was like just another like, really? Can we just get this thing already? All right, fine. It comes in May. So surprisingly... We were gonna get it in April. My mom suddenly got an email saying it's out for delivery. And so it's Friday and we got it. So that's my whole song and dance on this thing. That's why I'm doing this video because let's hope that it was worth this super long wait since October of last year. And hopefully it's gonna be a really cute addition to her very pink girly and kind of fairy tale like um, nursery. So let's kind of start the process. Let's unbox this thing. Le box. Let's do this. Okay, so just looking at it real close. It's very cute. It's very sturdy. Everything is really well made and it's definitely secure. Little foot. Cute little face. Rocks smoothly. It's very, very soft. Cute little tail. Little mohawk we got going on here. 
Another great thing about this is it's really light. So it's not like super bulky and heavy where, you know, it's hard to move around and, you know, take places or, you know, move out of the room if we need to. It's super light. So I think that's a plus on it. Also, the personalization is really nice. So I used to work for a company where they specialized in personalization. It was literally called Personal Creations. And I remember a lot of testing that the products had to go through, with, especially with wood products, on getting the personalization right and making it you know, come out nicely and be good quality and it to not be poorly done, color not be right, or the letters be crooked or uneven. Um, so that's something that I got very familiar with, with personalization. So seeing this, I'm very happy with how it came out. I think they did a really good job. I knew it would be absolutely adorable, but it's so cute. It's in a little unicorn. It's so soft. It's definitely worth it. And I wish I could say, go out there and buy it. But unfortunately, what my mom learned through all this back order mess was that this line is actually being discontinued, which is part of the reason why it was such a hot commodity and it was taking so long to be delivered. They did a special edition line. So... I'm glad we snagged it when we did. Tune for the next video. Thanks, guys. Say bye, Ashley. <laughs> Say bye.